Yechezkeel, Ezekiel 13. And the word of Yahuwah came unto me, saying, Son of Adam, prophesy against the prophets of Yeshadael that prophesy. And say unto them that prophesy out of their own hearts, Hear ye the word of Yahuwah. Thus says Adonai Yahuwah, Woe unto the foolish prophets that follow their own ruach and have seen nothing. O Yashadael, your prophets are like the foxes in the deserts. Ye have not gone up into the gaps, neither made up the hedge for the house of Yashadael to stand in the battle in the day of Yahuwah. They have seen vanity and lying divination, saying Yahuwah says, and Yahuwah has not sent them. And they have made others to hope that they would confirm the word. Have ye not seen a vain vision? And have ye not spoken a lying, a lying divination? Whereas ye say, Yahuwah says it, albeit I have not spoken. Therefore thus says Adonai Yahuwah, Because ye have spoken vanity and seen lies, therefore behold, I am against you says Adonai Yahuwah, and my hand shall be upon the prophets that see vanity and that divine lies. They shall not be in the assembly of my people, neither shall they be written in the writing of the house of Yashadael, neither shall they enter into the land of Yashadael, and ye shall know that I am Adonai Yahuwah, because, even because they have seduced at my people, saying, Peace, and there was no peace, and one built up a wall, and lo, others daubed it with untempered mortar. Say unto them which daub it with untempered mortar, that it shall fall. There shall be an overflowing shower, and ye, O great hailstones, shall fall, and a stormy wind shall rend it. Lo, when the wall is fallen, shall it not be said unto you, Where is the daubing wherewith ye have daubed it? Therefore thus says Adonai Yahuwah, I will even rend it with a stormy wind in my fury, and there shall be an overflowing shower in my anger, and great hailstones in my fury to consume it. So will I break down at the wall that ye have daubed with untempered mortar, and bring it down to the ground, so that the foundation thereof shall be discovered, and it shall fall and ye shall be consumed in the midst thereof. And ye shall know that I am Yahuwah. Thus will I accomplish my wrath upon the wall, and upon them that have daubed it with untempered mortar, and will say unto you, The wall is no more, neither they that daubed it. To wit, the prophets of Yashadael, which prophesy concerning Yerushalayim, and which see visions of peace for her, and there is no peace, says Adonai Yahuwah. Likewise, son of Adam, set your face against the daughters of your people, which prophesy out of their own heart, and prophesy against them, and say, Thus says Adonai Yahuwah, Woe to the women that sew pillows to all armholes, and make kerchiefs upon the head of every stature to hunt souls. Will ye hunt the souls of my people, and will ye save the souls alive that come unto you? And will ye pollute me among my people for handfuls of barley 
and for pieces of bread, to slay the souls that should not die, and to save the souls alive that should not live. By your lying to my people that hear your lies, Wherefore, thus says Adonai Yahuwah, Behold, I am against your pillows, wherewith ye there hunteth the souls to make them fly, and I will tear them from your arms, and will let eth the souls go, even eth the souls that ye hunt to make them fly. Your eth veils also will I tear, and delivereth my people out of your hand. And they shall be no more in your hand to be hunted. And ye shall know that I am Yahuwah. Because with lies ye have made the heart of the righteous sad, whom I have not made sad, and strengthened the hands of the wicked, that he should not return from his wicked way, by promising him life. Therefore, ye shall see no more vanity, nor divine divinations. For I will delivereth my people out of your hand, and ye shall know that I am Yahuwah.